Hi everybody, it is Anne Gendra. You found what to play next. Am I am I gonna be sideways? This looks like an up and down game, but we will find out because it's loading. Um, it's archaeology. I love archaeology. I took it in college. I had to find the classroom, long story, but um so cool. So I wanted to check it out. Um different kind of sandbox, but real actual sandbox. And they do the coolest things. I hope that they stay like kind of true to the science of it. But we'll see. It's a, it's a lot more than Jurassic... Well, it's not a whole lot more than Jurassic Park implied because they did go into, like, how you have to date stamp and whatever um, in order to find out where to dig down and what it means. But they, like, contrast that with Velociraptors, so... There was a focus. A focus difference there. And then, of course, I'm reading Uncharted, The Fourth Labyrinth, so... Because Nathan Drake is my boyfriend. He just hasn't found out yet. Tap dig my museum. He's a lot of our boyfriends. We know. All right, so we get a thousand coins and I can click on the dino head. Who wouldn't? We could take a pic to an exhibit that is interior to a museum. Heck yes. What shall we find? I already got it. And then you get extra coins. Like I said, I'm knowing where to dig is considered a huge part of the science. Um, there's, in the same way that when you do research, you have a specific scatter pattern, it is exactly the same with archeology span and you are supposed to do it in a very similar manner. So um, we're getting coinage here, is that what this is about? Okay. So um, you do X research. Oh, that's what I missed prior. Um, you do X research to find out, you know, what you're going after and what their usual patterns are. But then you have, you know, um, like a staggered approach so that you um, unearth the most possible about what you're looking at. All right, so what are we doing here? Let's pick up some coins from our visitors. So now we have a dino tail and a dino head. Oh, okay, so this is taking us to the dig. What do we have for pictures? What is Okay, what that does is stops my camera. <laughs> Apparently you can take a screenshot, but I already know how to do that. Still thank you. Thank you to you, um, the producers there. Let's see, anything else? Okay, so we're gonna burn through this. Let's see how fast we can get dino parts, because I want to know what's next. So let's find out what's next. What do we have? We're at 20%. How fast can you dig, friend? Can I dig faster than your attention span is the real question. Always the real question. Ooh, I got a backbone. <laughs> this is... There are days when I hope that my ex does not watch my channel. Today is one of those days, surprisingly. Uh, so anyways. Um, okay, so like I said, sometimes you do hit something off the drop. Sometimes you need to, like even for getting grant money, stuff like that, you do need to be able to justify it. So there is a little bit of exterior plumbing where you see if you find things around a dig site. But a big chunk of it is, you know, like finding out what's going on interior to that. We've got a leg up. What are we at? 40%? We're trucking. Let's get this whole thing. So yeah, like I said, you need to be able to find stuff. Not just, um, prove a, it's not as much about proving a point as adding to the research so that, you know, Indiana Jones style, you can have competition, um, but also, you know, like the, it's a friendly sort of rivalry um, in the scientific field, or at least it's supposed to be. We assume it is. Um, like I said, I only took the one class and then I got into ethnography, which is the study of culture real time. Um, you are also supposed to do X research, you know, um, prior to, during, or um, during the compilation of, um, and so on. So it looks like we are out on the dig site. So my hypothesis was incorrect. Ooh, we got another. It looks like a leg. It might be a forearm. And then it looks like there might be two here, but I don't think I'm going to be able to hit that. So there's another crate open. We can go back in and get it. Ooh, my velociraptor looks like is... I think we can get it this time. As you can see, I'm kind of like, I'm being systemic here. And we finished our dino. So let's see what the world has to offer then. 
Do we just immediately, oh, 90%. Do we just immediately like go on to a different dino? I mean, as far as point and click goes, this is cute. I wouldn't necessarily call it a seek and find. If you're already interested in it, it's fun. Um, it teaches you a little bit. Oh, and two crates come in. All right, so it was a Velociraptor. It does build the name as you go also, so that's cool. Did it open up anything else? It did. So we go to a new dig site on the main map. And we have a new dinosaur open up. So this is really cute. Um, we'll click through once and see if it has anything extra, but I'm going to go ahead and do my outro. So I'm Anjindra, and this is what to play next. We find everything that is awesome in gaming, so we love poking around stuff like this that is a little bit different. Um, we always want to see what direction gaming is going in, you know, like what's new, what's out there, how's it going, what's it doing, that sort of thing. Um, so we love finding stuff like this especially. Hit like, hit subscribe. We did partner with Gamer Grind. Um, so if you've never had anything but a couple of Folgers, drop the 20 bucks. It's like a bottle of wine where it has flavor, or a good bottle of whiskey where it has flavor. So it really will improve your morning experience. I think we all need that right now. So um, hit like, hit subscribe. We will see you in the next video. And as always, much love.